Susan was always known as the artistic genius in her small town. From a young age, she had a natural talent for painting and drawing. That left everyone in awe. By the time she was 16, she had already won numerous awards for her work and was on the path to becoming a renowned artist. However, everything changed one fateful day when Susan was involved in a car accident. That left her with a brain injury in her temporal cortex. The doctors were unsure of the extent of the damage, but they warned Susan and her family that there was a possibility. She may never be able to create art again. After months of intense therapy and rehabilitation, Susan finally returned home with a new outlook on life. While she may have lost some of her memory and cognitive abilities, her passion for art remained as strong as ever. And to everyone's amazement, Susan's artwork seemed to have taken on a whole new level of creativity. At first, Susan herself was surprised by the changes in her work. Her paintings now had a whimsical and almost surreal quality to them. With vibrant colors and unexpected shapes that seemed to leap off the canvas, she found herself experimenting with new techniques and mediums, creating masterpieces that left art critics scratching their heads in confusion. One day, Susan decided to hold an exhibition of her new work. In the town's art gallery, the local art community was abuzz with excitement, eager to see what the once great artist had in store. As the opening night approached, Susan couldn't help but feel anxious. Would her new style be embraced by the public, or would they see it as a bizarre departure from her previous work? The night of the exhibition arrived, and the gallery was packed with people eager to see Susan's latest creations. As she stood nervously by her paintings, she couldn't help but overhear the whispers of the crowd. Some were puzzled by her new style, while others were enthralled by the imaginative creativity that seemed to flow from her damaged brain. Suddenly, a group of art critics approached Susan, their faces. A mask of skepticism. Ms. Susan, can you explain the inspiration behind your latest work? One of them asked, eyeing her paintings with a critical gaze. Susan chuckled nervously, trying to find the words to describe her unique vision. Well, you see, after my accident, I discovered a whole new world of creativity in my brain. It's like my temporal cortex took a little vacation and came back. Bursting with ideas, she joked, hoping to lighten the mood. To her surprise, the critics began to nod in understanding, as if her explanation had unlocked a hidden truth in her art. They started discussing the intricate symbolism and metaphorical depth of her paintings, interpreting them in ways that Susan hadn't even considered. As word of Susan's exhibition spread, the gallery became a sensation overnight. People from all over the country flocked to see her work, eager to experience the mind-bending beauty that emerged from her injured brain. Art collectors clamored to purchase her pieces, and soon, Susan found herself thrust into the spotlight as the hottest new artist on the scene. Despite her newfound success, Susan remained humble and grateful for the second chance at life that her brain injury had given her. She continued to create art that defied convention and challenged the boundaries of imagination, inspiring others to see the beauty in imperfection and the magic in the unexpected. And so, Susan's brain story became a legend in the art world. A tale of resilience, creativity, and the power of the human spirit. To overcome even the most devastating of obstacles. As she looked out at the sea of admirers who had come to celebrate her talent, Susan couldn't help but smile. After all, who knew that a little bump on the head could lead to such a stroke of genius?